We got flight. We all see his reaction for, for this. Derrick Rose retired from the NBA, man. He had a great career. He missed the full season because of the ACL injury, and he came back. Flight team stand up. Wow. It was him and Kobe, my two favorite players. Kobe was the first one I saw play basketball in the NBA. I thought, at one point in time, I thought Kobe was the only player in the NBA. Kobe and his teammates against all the evil villains. That's what I, <laughs> that's what I thought. It's absolutely crazy, man. Multiple back-to-back -back leads blown. And IRL basketball 1v1s. Huh? Now, my third favorite player of all time. Is officially retiring. The Charizard dude. He caught on Charizard. You know, he's going to be the main source. Well, it's retired. It's going to be him. Him and Wendy. Wendy Bomb. Announced that Derrick Rose after Windbreaker. NBA seasons is officially retiring from basketball. Retiring from the NBA. The Warriors got Kevin Knox. MVP in NBA history. The next chapter is about chasing his dreams and his growth. First of all, man, can we get a moment of applause to Derrick Goes, Derrick Rose. Damn, man, this one hurts, man. This one hurts. This one hurts. This one hurts. Now, first of all, I want to thank Derrick Rose, man, for all the years he's provided with the entertainment-wise uh, basketball. I've been watching Derrick Rose since he was at Simeon High School, all the way up into the Memphis Tigers, and all the way up into the NBA, man. Um... It was just his Grizzlies. I just hated the way his um later half of his career ended with the injuries, such as with his knees and stuff like that. I also didn't like the way um the Chicago Bulls traded him. Yeah, front office I felt like mistreated him. Yeah, still to this day I feel like they could have kept Rose on the team the entire time. Yeah, or at least could have had Rose retire as a Bull or yep. something like that. Um, I mean the least they can do I feel like they should definitely retire Derrick Rose's number. Yeah. He better. This hurts, man. I definitely would would have loved to see at least Derrick Rose have a hundred percent one more healthy season. I know obviously he's not the Derrick Rose from the MVP year, but I would have rather have him just one more season. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know what I'm saying just to go full throttle. Um, but man, it hurts, man. You know, and it, it's also showing that like, hey, man, like time is really going by. Yep. You know, like, bro, I wasn't like. Middle school when Derrick Rose came into the league and yeah, know, I was in was elementary like, school, bro. I won an MVP when I was in elementary school. Dang. I mean that low key took me another way. Like I ain't gonna lie, but like at the end of the day, like it's crazy. Like, Coming right like, towards ACL. Your yeah, like, tips, <laughs> tips. But uh, uh, I'll jump to the side he towards ACL. Then he came back. Then like two games after the uh. Uh, he saw the following season. Then he came back. The two games he tore his meniscus. Like, dang. The NBA stars. When he came back. And he said it was a blessing in disguise, too, because he found out who he was outside of basketball. So it was actually a blessing in disguise. That's what he said last year. During media day with the Grizzlies. Even like the 2010s. It's getting to a point where they're going to start retiring, man. The NBA is getting to that part where yeah. it's like really shifting yep. to a whole nother, you know what I'm saying, generation of players, man. Yep. It's You're time right. we had a heart to heart about our. Talking about Devon, I know you want to Devon. Percent of business leaders report a lack of diversity in their work. Mm -hmm. Now we're talking about LeBron retiring. Talking about CP3 retiring. Um, first of all, comment down below. What is your favorite memory of Derrick Rose? When was the first time you found out about Rose? I found out about him. There's a lot of memories, man. When There's he hit that game winner on uh, Lakers on Christmas. When he hit that game winner on Lakers on Christmas. Or when he hit that game winner against the Cavs in uh, 2015 playoffs. Bro, so many. We hit that game against the uh, Bucks, bro, in 2012. Or oh, what else? What else, man? When he dumped on Goran Dragic. So many memories, bro. They hit that reverse windmill against the Celtics, that little reverse dunk against the Knicks. Favorite, you know what I'm saying? When he had that 50 point game with the Timberwolves, bro. Back when he was playing with the Memphis Tigers, I seen it. You know what I'm saying? I knew he was going to be an NBA superstar by the way he played. Even when he was playing on Memphis, and people remember, he wasn't even averaging that crazy amount of points. I yeah. knew he was going to be a superstar. Calipari was on that team, that's why. You ain't averaging no crazy stats on Calipari team. Um, and I honestly wish, too, that the Bulls did get a better team surrounding Rose. You know what I'm saying? Other than, you know, trash Jakeem Noah. <laughs> Bro, you know, was a two-time All-Star and Defensive Player of the Year flight. Stop it. Um, you know, the other one. He get rid of Boozer. <laughs> Boozer, dang, dang, was solid. Uh, CJ Watson. 
football players and stuff like that. I feel like he should have had a lot more of a um, better longevity if he had players around him. But, hey, man, it is what it is. LeBron, and also LeBron and D-Wade almost went to the Bulls, bro, to team up with D-Rose. But they decided to go with the, to the Heat. That would have been crazy! LeBron and D-Rose in Chicago? LeBron, D-Rose, and D-Wade in Chicago, bro? Derrick Rose officially retired. We'll also read some NBA news, too, because you guys know the NBA season is right around the corner. NBA preseason officially starts next week, and then the NBA oh, yeah. season starts at the I'm end. not ready no preseason games, bro. Get on to the real stuff. That's the only I react to. I don't react to uh, 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 regular season. I'm like 2K, bro. Sim, sim preseason, bro. Month of October. Um, we got the ball is life right here, too. Derrick Rose has a goodbye message, and he has an introduction video. You see the pictures right here from Rose. Um, hey, Rose has to be an official top five point guard of all time. I think it's safe to say to put him in that category. <laughs> prime Rose, I don't think anybody. And it's prime, yes. Maybe Curry, obviously. Yeah, it's prime Rose. Rose. Okay. Rose, okay, okay prime. Curry. Okay, put him in there. I think. Curry. Well, no, there's no particular order. Curry, Westbrook, Rose, Magic, and uh, uh, Isaiah Thomas. Curry at number one point guard. Maybe if you want to list Iverson at point guard, I personally list Iverson as like the shooting guard. Yeah, me too. I put Iverson as a shooting guard. And then you put Rose right after that, man. There's nobody that comes, you know what I'm saying, anywhere to where Prime Rose is at a true point guard um, outside of just Steph Curry. And then here's this Rose goodbye message. Thank you, my first love. Believe in me through highs, lows, constant with everything. All, right, all right, flight. We're not going to. I ain't come see you read, bro. I don't know. We gonna do it anyway. We gonna watch this anyway. Um, outside of just Steph Curry, and here's this Rose goodbye message. Thank you, my first love. Believe in me through highs, lows, constant with everything seemed uncertain. You showed me what truly meant. You turned into sanctuary home where I could express freely. You made early morning, late night spent together. Every drop sweat. Uh, you reminded me I could always rely on you. That every moment of doubt, you would show me what I'm capable of. Introduce me to new places and cultures that a kid Chicago could have never imagined. You taught me that every loss was a lesson, uh, win was a reason to be grateful. You offered wisdom that was not just about the game, about life, discipline, hard work, perseverance. You showed me through passion and something to cherish, ensuring that I pour heart into every dribble, every shot, every play. You stood by me when even the world seemed against me unconditionally waiting for me to pick you up you gave gift our time together one that i would cherish for the rest of my days you told me it's okay to say goodbye reassure me that you'll always be a part of me no matter where life takes me forever derrick goes derrick rose and then here's what he posted um on his latest ig page hopefully you guys can see it's like that quad okay i can make the quality better Bro, 394p? Is this 2005? Elon! Okay. Maybe it's better if I view it this way. This is really sad, man. Now, remember the last time we got pranked by, like, these, uh, these fake NBA blog pages saying that he <laughs> retired earlier in the year? And he never did, and now it's official. Man, that cliffhanger is real. What do you guys think is next for Derrick Rose? I would love to see him be involved in the media, definitely. I don't want to see him just be, like, just completely disappear from, like, the face of the earth and stuff like that. Um, definitely want to see him Tim you know, Duncan involved in, in everything like that in the media. You don't got to go into the media, D-Rose. You don't got to listen to this man right here, bro. This man can't even make, barely make a layup. Don't listen to him, D-Rose. You don't need to go into the media if you don't want to. Um, hey man, shout out to Derrick Rose. He, he can do what we doing. He can do what he's just, you know what I'm saying, be a YouTuber. True king, uh, true, you know what I'm saying, uh, fighter and true warrior. Um, he should be an automatic first ballot Hall of Fame. You know what I'm saying? And his jersey number needs to be retired. Nothing else said. Derrick Rose is literally the second best Chicago Bulls player of all time, obviously behind Michael Jordan. Um, Duh. What's the problem with anything that I'm, you know what I'm saying? Yep. So, Not Scotty Pippen. He's a, he's a buzz guy. Scotty Pippen, Pippen don't got no MVP. Man. All right, so we got some uh, free agency news. Last Kevin week, Knox. Before the NBA season officially starts. Kevin Knox has a... All right, that's my cue. I'm out of here. Eee!